Hello! In this tutorial, we're going to talk about uh, Google uh, Statistics uh, in GoThrough. Now, I'm um, going to go to Portfolio section, and in here, we're going to find out a uh, stat button for each of your tour. Now, let's click on it, and we're going to find uh, a few graphs in here, and let's go ahead and discuss them. Now, the first graph, I will start with the second graph. Uh, and basically, the way go through collect statistics is every Monday, we take a snapshot from Google for all the views from all your panoramas in that tour. And then we store that value. And in this particular graph, the, the graph will always go up because every week it's going to be accumulative. Now, going to the first graph, this uh, does a difference between two weeks. So in week one, what's going to happen is we have the difference between week one and week 52, and that's 214. Then we have here the difference between week two and week one and that's 121 so these are how many views the tour got between those two uh, dates so let's go further and in this graph um, what we do is we also collect the all the views uh, a panorama gets uh, and we store for the first three panoramas this value. So in this particular case, the first panorama is this one and it has 13% uh, percent from all views that this tour got. And this is the second one, the third one, and all the other panoramas got, got the 70. You know? So the tour has 17 panoramas. So all the other 14 got 70% from and we're going to take this data and do something similar with what we did here with, with the difference between week by week, but for the first three panels. So this would be how many views this panel got per week. So between week 52 and, 50, uh, and week 1, we got the blue one got 17. This, uh, this one, the second image got 15 and this one got 13. So this is how you read the statistics uh, by go through. Besides this, um, you will notice here that we have a, a few more buttons and this is a button is share statistics and when you click on it, go through will create a unique link that can be shared with um, with your client so no need for your client to log in and the beauty of this link is that whenever you we scan like every monday when we scan the the link the the, the page will be updated with the new data um so if i'm going uh, uh I'm doing here I'm trying to go to this page so when if I'm going for example here and I'm clicking create PDF PDF we will create a, a PDF file and this one can be downloaded and sent also to to a client um, so what I would do right now, I would go and, for example, look for a tour that was published long time ago. So we're going to see, for example, how statistics are looking uh, for an older tour. So you see, in this particular case, um, you know, we start collecting the data in week 11 of uh, 2018 and then it just accumulated accumulated and in here we we notice like 
the differences of how many views this tour got between the two weeks so some weeks were like higher some weeks were uh, lower uh, this is how a graph that has uh, some, you know, some now one thing to notice about the statistics is that we collect the statistics only for pro accounts and um, if your account doesn't is not pro anymore then you're gonna have a gap so if you take a, a break in your pro account you're gonna have like a, a gap in your statistics for the break that you took also um, we collect uh, statistics from the moment the tour is published and go through so if you have a tour for example uh, that was published like in 2015 we or not they'd be able to have all the data from 15 till now it's only when you add it in go through um, or yeah if you've been a pro account if you had a pro account since uh, 2018 then we would collect all this data for you yeah. thank you for watching uh, this tutorial video about go through google statistics